Rustard is the epitome of the of uh, the watchdog journalist, the guy who wouldn't let you get away with spin. He was the one who epitomized the idea that uh, you were to be held accountable for your words and your actions in this town, and and that is uh, what uh, Washington journalism is supposed to be about. We're not about it enough, uh, but Tim Rustard, uh, you know, really did live and breathe that ethic. And you didn't make it in Washington until you were on the set of Meet the Press, and you've been grilled by uh, Tim Rustard. Uh, more than one presidential candidate lived or died; their campaign rose or fell. Uh, based on how they did on his show, and uh, whether you're a cabinet secretary or uh, you know a first-term congressman, if you were on his show, it was a big deal. And if you survived his show, if you survived his grilling, you'd made it to the prime time. Um, and plus, he was the kind of guy you'd see him at a ball game, you'd see him at a bar, see him at a restaurant. Always had a big smile, always had a handshake, always talking about his family. He loved his his uh, his kids and his wife. And uh, as everybody knows, his uh, father. He wrote this incredible book, one of my favorite books, Big Russ and Me. Um, about uh, his working class father who was part of the greatest generation and, and the kind of influence that his dad had on, had on him and like a, a, a lot of dads that had a, a, a that generation had on people of Tim's generation. I, I really think that's what he's going to be remembered for. It's a big tragedy. A lot of people hurting in town today.